get so boring hanging out at this orphanage all by myself. All I want is for someone to adopt me. I've been here for what feels like 35 years. I mean, I I'm not 35, but it feels like it's been that long. Well, at least I got my best friend, Mr. Monkey, here to hang out with me. Nice monkey, loser! Hey, don't make fun of my monkey. He's pretty cool. Yeah, right. An ugly monkey for an ugly kid. <laughs> are, are you calling me ugly? That's really mean. Why would you say such a thing? Hey, I'm just trying to be honest here. You're gross! No, I'm not. Why would you say that? Yucky, yucky. <laughs> Ew! Gross! Brittany's gross! Why are you being so mean? I'm not being mean. The truth hurts sometimes. You're super ugly. You're just jealous that I have a cool monkey stuffed animal and, and you're mean. That monkey is Whatever. I don't need your opinion about me anyway. All right, all right. There's a mom here to adopt. Oh my gosh! Uh, do you think I could get adopted? This would be amazing. Well, we all know who isn't getting adopted. We do? Who? Stinky monkey, stinky kid, you, duh! Miss, you think I still get a chance to get adopted, right? I mean, I, I don't see why no one would want to adopt me. Well, she has a point. No one wants you because you're ugly and no one wants an ugly kid. Maybe I don't have a chance to get adopted. I'm sick of everyone calling me ugly. So, lady, can we go play outside away from this stinky, gross lady? Of course. I don't want to be around her either. Ugh, I don't want to catch her ugly. <laughs> Later, stinky. Have fun never being adopted ever, ever, ever because you're gross. Maybe I am just an ugly child. Maybe I'm meant to live in this orphanage forever. Nobody wants me. I'm gonna be that old lady that works here and everyone's just gonna hate me because I'm gross and ugly. It's awful. I just want somebody to care about me, even just like a little bit. But no, I'm too ugly and I'm gonna live here for the rest of my life. They're the people who want to adopt kids. I'm probably just gonna have to sit here and let all the other kids get adopted. So, these are the only available kids? Yes, ma'am. Hey, honey, I have a great idea. Now listen, it's gonna sound crazy, but trust me, it's like the coolest idea ever. How funny would it be if we adopted the ugliest kid here? Oh my gosh, it'd be so awesome. Wait, these people want to adopt an ugly kid? Maybe it's my time to shine seeing as I'm the ugliest one. <laughs> oh my God, we should. That would be totally funny seeing as we're like world famous supermodels. Supermodels with an ugly child? It's almost the best idea. The photos would be incredible. I think they only want to adopt me as a joke. No, I don't want to be taken as a joke. I, I want to be taken and loved like any other kid wants. Yeah, maybe we can teach her to not be so ugly. I mean, it's real hard, but somebody's got to try. Okay, it's settled then. We'll take the ugly one, please. Hey, oh man, she's perfect. Oh, I can't wait for this experiment. It's gonna be awesome. Look, Mom, I don't know how many times I have to tell you. I am who I am, and I'm sorry it's not good enough for you. Sorry is not good enough. Jeez. You put all this pressure on me learning how to be a model, and I just, I can't do it, Mom. It's not in the cards for me. Have you even tried to not be ugly? Like, seriously, it's not difficult. Like, have you ever heard of makeup? Mom, I'm too young to wear makeup, and I like the way I look. You like that you look like my grandma's toes? What? Are you serious? Are you saying I'm that ugly? Mom? I've been saying it. My gosh, Brittany, why don't you ever listen? You need to go watch some TikToks and learn about fashion. No, I don't, Mom. That's not what I like to look at on TikTok. I like to follow the Brittany plays, which you guys need to make sure that you do. That's my TikTok. Why can't you just accept me for who I am? I don't accept anything ugly, so like, don't know what to tell you. Whatever, Mom. It looks like you'll never accept me. I'm gonna go. I think Rachel's outside, and I'm gonna go hang out with her. Parents are the worst. I just don't understand that 
all they care about is looks. I mean, there's so much more to life. Like, I don't know, everything else. Rachel, hey, girl. My gosh, I'm so sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, sorry. <laughs> hey, Britt. How's your day going? Pretty good. I'm watering flowers. <laughs> I gotta tell you something. I am literally having the worst day ever. What's going on? My mom, she's just getting on my case again, saying that I'm ugly and that I need to watch more TikToks and Instagram about fashion and I just don't wanna do it. Why can't my mom accept me for who I am like you do? That's lame. I'm sorry, Britt. At least I have you as a next door neighbor and best friend so I can at least escape how awful my parents are. You know. You should be able to do whatever makes you happy. And if it's not what they like, then who cares? I know. That's why you're so lucky to be with a family that cares about you and lets you do whatever you want. It's okay. It'll get better someday, Britt. Ugh, Britt, what do you think you're doing? Oh, uh, Mom, I told you I'm just hanging out with Rachel. How could you hang out with another ugly kid? I thought one was bad enough, but oh my gosh, there are Two of you in Brookhaven? Mom, are you serious? Rachel's not ugly. And why does it matter what my friends look like? This is so horrible for my image. Come on, we are going home. No, I don't want to go home with you, Mom. I, uh, uh I gotta go. I'll, I'll catch you later, Britt. Oh, Rachel, please don't leave. Yeah, you should go, ugly kid. Ew, Death. Disgusting. Mom, I can't believe you do that. I need to wash my eyes after seeing that disgusting thing. <sighs> I'm so glad that the school day is over. It was a rough one, guys. I had to learn about World War history. Like, ugh. But I am just waiting for my mom, and she said she was on the way, but knowing her, she's just gonna take her sweet time. Checking your phone, ugly. I bet you have zero followers. No, guys, it's Melissa, my biggest bully in school. What do you want? Oh, nothing. I just saw you here and had to say that you're ugly. Why can't you just leave me alone? All you do is make fun of me. You're just like everyone else. You know what? I don't need this. You're so mean. I am out of here. Oh, my gosh. Guys, I can't believe it. It's Noah, my big crush. Oh my gosh, he is so cool. He's like the smartest one in our grid. I'm gonna go see what he's up to. Hey, hey Noah, how's it going? Oh, hey, Britt. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. I get so nervous around Noah. He's like so cute. I just had to put some books away. My backpack's getting real heavy. Yeah, I mean, I bet it is. You have to carry around like the massive textbooks because you're in all like AP classes. You're so smart, Noah. Oh, thanks, bro. Oh, hey, you too. I just wanted to say congrats. Uh, about what? Oh my gosh, you don't know? Gosh, you silly. I'm kind of lost here. Don't look at me. I'm just as confused as you are. Oh my gosh, you two won the cutest couple award in the yearbook. Didn't you see? We did? I didn't know you liked me. Oh my gosh, yes. Here, see for yourself. Oh my gosh, are you are you serious? <gasps> <laughs> Got you, loser. <laughs> they voted us the ugliest couple in all of the world? I don't think you're ugly. I actually think you're really pretty. You do? That really makes me smile. Barrett, hurry up. Mom, you won't believe what just happened to Noah and I. So all the kids at school voted us ugliest couple in the world. <laughs> are you laughing right now? Well, are they wrong? Yeah, uh, of course they're wrong. Let's just say, like, I'm not really surprised here. Mom! Brett, uh, I'll see you around. I can't believe you. You're the worst. Here we are at the lake, just relaxing. Gosh, I wonder what life would be like if our kid wasn't so ugly. You realize I'm skinny. 
standing right here. Yeah, but see, like, I don't know, we've been thinking. There's so much you can do to improve yourself. Improve myself? Seriously? You guys don't have to be so hard on me all the time. I get it when I was a kid, but I'm an adult now. You know what? The more I think about it, I'm like kind of embarrassed to be around you. Embarrassed of me? Why? You guys are so judgmental. It's not all about looks, you know. You know what? I think we need to get out of here and away. Like, far, far away. Yeah, the sun's not on me anymore, so, like, I'm over it. We're leaving. Are you guys just gonna, like, abandon me here? Yeah, bye, ugly. Good luck. I'm not being ugly. <gasps> I can't believe it. My parents are ditching me at the lake because I'm ugly? What? Are you for real? Mom, Dad, what the... Oh, my gosh! Mom! Dad! Are you okay? Oh my gosh, my mom and dad just got out of surgery and I am so glad that they're okay. I'm gonna go see them for the first time and oh. I'm a monster, wow, my face, my beautiful face. I know the bruises and scars kind of look intense right now, but you're not ugly. I mean, you'll be back to normal in no time. Don't worry. <laughs> Dad, it's really hard to understand what you're saying with your face all wrapped up like that. I'm just happy you're both okay. He said, we're sorry, Britt. What? <laughs> yeah, we were so mean to you. I'm a little sad that it took a horrible car accident for you guys to realize that you were mean to me, but thanks for apologizing now. <laughs> Dad, I'm gonna have to get you a notepad or something because I don't really understand what you're trying to say. Well, I guess this means you are the best looking one in the family now. Mom, I thought you just realized that looks aren't everything. Mm -hmm.